Hey everybody and welcome to day five of the Golden Goblet. Two. This is day eleven. Twelve. It's day twelve, right? It's day twelve. Okay. Um, just allow me. I'm trying to make sure I queued for solos. Did I queue for solos or did I queue for trios? I thought I had a member in my squad there a second ago. Um, I sure hope. I'm not accidentally in squads with no fill. Is there any way to check? You know what? I don't trust it. I don't trust That's all I'm gonna say. I tried to start the- Okay, we were in solos. I tried to start the episode right at us being like into the game to get maximum dopamine as early as possible, but... I wanted to make sure, you know, I don't want a Yi to run for no reason. So, welcome back. I'm glad so many people are enjoying the Warzone. Thanks for your support. Um... There's nothing to be said about the performances so far. I'm actually, like, not displeased with my performances at all. Um, it's the other two dudes are pogging out of their freaking gourd. I mean, what do you... Hello? Why am I so large now? This, this is way too big. What the heck happened? Whoa. Oh. Uh, I, I clicked something. I don't know what I clicked, but I clicked something. Um, I mean, honestly, what can you say? Malf put down a first place and a second place in his first two days. I'm not disappointed. Like, legitimately, I'm not disappointed in myself rocking, like, uh, you know, 5th, 30th. That 70th was pretty bad. But, like, I feel like... I've been doing all right. And I can't really control how well the other guys do. If anything, I'm very happy for them to be doing so well. Um, we're going we're gonna to try to do our best today. I did make some alterations previously, like on Team Unity Tuesday, a couple of days ago, uh, a few days ago now. I used um, a thermal scope. I'm here to tell you, I think the thermal scope is not for me. I'm, for my loadout, I should say, specifically. I think for me, I'm more of a hybrid scope guy. And I also took, like, aim down sights to make that as quickly as possible. I, I, or I organized all of my perks to be around... Oh, hello. To be around aiming down sights. Honestly, you deserve that one. You, you outplayed me slightly. I think... You know, Call of Duty, it appears to be a game where one click makes all the difference. If you mess up one click, that could be the end of you. You tried to drop shot me. You know what? I'm not mad, just disappointed. That's okay. That's okay. You only get two shots in that shotgun. Get ready. Get, your, get ergoed. Get set up. And then we'll look at the circle here. We'll look at the circle. Where? How we doing? Honestly, I love a mouth suburbs drop. We can afford to play a little cowardly here. Sorry, not mouth suburbs. Malferly Hills. That's where I want to drop. Dropping in Malferly Hills. Okay. So just, just focus. Just focus. You know, we can't control... Um, well, I mean, we can control how we do, but you know what I mean when I say that, right? Like, we can't fully control how we do. A, a large chunk of how we do is essentially just going to come down to a couple of the universe's Plinko chips falling. If you know what I mean. We're going to try to do the best we can. I think that's probably where we can drive. There are only 10 people left in the plane. I'm going to assume that it's going to be pretty hot here, though. Why would you pull? Dude, people are not going Boneyard anymore. They're going for Malferly Hills. So that's my first little deviation there. Don't shoot me. Coward. You're a coward. I'm landing in first class. Now, we could be getting rushed down pretty quick here. Doesn't mean you have to run. Just means get yourself ready. There could be people in the boneyard, too. Just take a deep breath. Start looting. 
And I think also recognize you did a. We did a darn good job, in my opinion. I took the wrong gun. One moment, please. We did a darn good job, in my opinion, of deviating on our drop there. If we hadn't deviated on our drop, that could have been a complete disaster. Loot's a little subpar. Really looking for that first armor plate. No reason not to go with the brush stroke. You think he saw? Oh! Here we go. Clean up the scraps. Let's go, boys. Great start. Full on armor plates. Mash that four button. We're back. I do expect it to heat up, don't get me wrong. I don't really like the Odin. A little bit too slow to shoot. An M4 would be worth a lot to me. He had an Odin as well, no wonder we beat him. What do you got? Long range SMG. I'll take that over the Odin. I mean, we can use it up close. It's just going to be a little finicky. Um, probably the next step I would start to think of there would be like, hey, what about... And you, you might... Oh, I do love the M4. Even at merely on common level with one attachment, which is not a, a sight, I like it. Um, the next step I would think of is like, you know, get out of here. There was shooting back there. I'm looking for, like, a buy station that also has some rooftops near it. And I think we can start to make our way. I would like to get, um, like, a self-revive is pretty good. Another thousand gold, we get self-revive and UAV. And we, we love getting that first loadout drop because it comes with a... Uh, it comes with a heartbeat sensor, which is just, like... So many people online are rocking... That cold-blooded perk that means they don't get picked up by the heartbeat sensor. Or UAVs for that matter. I, I saw the tracers there. But we don't really have to worry about that. Like, well, I mean, we literally have to worry about that. But what I, I guess mean to say is it's kind of above my uh, weight class. So just stay frosty. I'm stoked we got a kill. We already... Beat our performance on Team Unity Tuesday last week. <laughs> Someone left a great comment. That was like... Team Unity Tuesday this week. Was like watching Space Jam. After all the basketball players lose their power. It's hard for me to disagree. I think it was a situation, you know, we've all been playing a lot of solos. Oh, a heartbeat sensor. And by playing those solos, we didn't necessarily put ourselves in a great position to play well as a team. That's not for me, right? You know... It probably wasn't for me. But you'd like to be sure. Very dangerous roof. This is where I live now. Maybe not forever. So if you're not following Warzone meta, what's my next step? I saw him. To get... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To get our loadout so our M4 gets better. Anyone else feel like I'm getting punked by this guy right now? Like he's jumping around just trying to make sure he knows where I am. I don't mind milling your armor plates. Like that, that doesn't bother me at all.
There is something to be said. I feel like we should stop taking shots unless we're confident we're going to get the kill. So this is a move situation, in my opinion. Not that our previous spot was bad. But just that a reposition will, will do you a lot of good. I think I have a problem in this game. In that the roofs... Feel safe. But may not actually be safe. And the places that are safe feel, like, unsafe. You know what I mean? I think it's like one of those... The closer you are to danger, the further you are from harm sort of situations. Like, that place is definitely looted. Based on the doors being open. And the chutes that are close by. And this door being open. I do like this roof, though. I look to this... This is one of my favorite roofs in the game. <laughs> well, I guess what I'm trying to say is... I don't see things changing for us. Not right now, at least. So I want to look near the other loadout drops. Like, I want to look near my own loadout just to see if anybody else got a drop near there they might come for. I'm just not, Here's the thing. You know what? I'm not good. Full stop. I'm not good at killing people um, with the sniper. That's not my, that's not my forte. Hold that angle. Somewhere around here. I'm, I'm more of a... I'm not even great at this, but I'm more of an up-close-and-personal kind of guy. So why am I constantly hanging out on rooftops? <laughs> it's a good question, right? I do have a game plan, though. I think, like, once the gas starts coming in... We're going to drop down, snag our loadout just to swap M4s. So we have my preferred M4 that I know and love. You hear that shooting? It's so quiet. The other guy was on that roof, by the way. That's, like, that's too far away to hit for me. It's too far away to kill. Hitting is one thing. Killing is, like, unlikely. But I think, like, if I was to rate, you know, my, my confidence right now, I don't feel too badly. Um, they were shooting down here. I don't feel too badly. Um, you know, we have decent weapons. We're going to give this a try. Probably more than decent. We just want to make sure we do grab this sniper instead of the rocket launcher. I thought I got shot at there, but we didn't. Let's go. I prefer the claymore. Uh, yeah, I prefer the claymore. If I'm going to camp, the claymore is where it's at. And oh, baby. Oh, baby. Now we're talking. Now... I feel in my heart of hearts we're in like UAV self-revive territory. No! No! He's right there! Oh my god. Such a deserved loss and yet still... So upsetting. I didn't ex I didn't expect anybody to have that kind of patience. Here you go. Take take some of this. Call me in the morning. I want you to glow like a Christmas tree when we're in there, buddy. I oh don't look at me like that. Look, I need all the help I can get. Okay, 
May light him up like the Fourth of July. Look right. Go left. Go left. Breath. Honestly, a truly devastating loss for me. I that one that one hurts to come in 49th place to somebody is just better at camping than I. Of course. Why don't you just go hang out near the buy station? What am I thinking? That's the, that's the new strat. Just go camp out at the buy station. Son of a... I'm not even mad because they, like... I mean, I'm mad, but I'm not mad because they were camping. I'm mad because they're just better at camping than me. For now, thanks for watching. We still came top third and we got one kill, which is, like, pretty okay for me. But, you know, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the episode, if you watched all 15 minutes and 56 seconds up to this point, I'm going to assume you did. Click the like button. It helps me out a great deal. We'll be back tomorrow to get them next time. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your support, and I'll see you then. See ya!